Life's changed for these children. I think it's safe to say the prayers have been answered. Sophia, Sasha, get your tablets. Let's go on to Google Classroom to correct homework, please. About five months ago, Sapphire and Sasha would be reaching for pens and pencils. But after Guardian Media highlighted the community's need for devices, the response was... That said night, a good Samaritan came forward and he bought 20. And the other day, the next day, we had other good Samaritans from all over Trinidad calling and asking to donate a device from as far as Lego Martin. For the kids, especially Sapphire, who has SEA coming up, this couldn't have come soon enough. It helped me a lot with my schoolwork, some better explanation with my work. I could see my teacher. If I don't understand the question, she could explain it, explain it more to me. I could see my friends. Um, I could even go on Google Classroom to get work that the teacher will send. Aspiring computer tech Randy can't stop exploring his device. And he's glad because now all he has to do is worry about completing his schoolwork rather than how he's getting it. The transporter dropped back the packages, which was a little difficult to find because um, people who really wasn't a really work taxi due to the COVID case. And the woman whose home for so long was a hub for those who needed a place to focus is overwhelmed with what she's seeing. There's more attention span, more learning carrying on, curriculum being transferred to them, and they are paying attention. I mean, in between, we must have those who will get a little bit fidgety, but it's working very, very good. But there's still a big problem. So devices in hand, mission accomplished, right? Not quite. That's just half the battle. You see, this pandemic taught us that internet is no longer a luxury, but rather a utility. And the people of this community are still waiting on a promise that was made to them just after we left here in November last year. That promise was made by the Telecommunications Authority in November last year. It said the authority was moved by their story and had commenced the process to find a service provider for underserved areas like Brasso Venado. I feel frustrated that I had to go and log on back again and that how my teacher might put my absent because I wasn't in class. Which, which are there? Yeah, there. But they're still heartened by their progress. And while Brasso Venado still has a lot more issues to sort out, at least their road to success is being paved.